Hello again, my brethren, and welcome. The Fortuna update launched almost a week ago, which saw a lot of cool features introduced into the game. I'll talk about the features in another video, but this one is focusing on creatures, and how to get them. I'd originally wrote off the hunting feature when I first heard about it, but I've come to like it. Not only that, but doing it efficiently can net you some good standing. To start, you need to get the tranquilizer gun and echo lures from the business, or biz, in Fortuna. I'm not sure what freaks me out more. The fact that his name sounds like that of a mob boss, or that I used to have a cat named Biz. While both are equally creepy, push that aside, grab what you can, and equip the train gun in your gear wheel. Head into the Vallis, and let's begin. First, equip your train gun from the gear wheel. Then select what you want to hunt by holding down the number 2 and selecting the animal echo lure that you're going for. Hold down your map button, don't just tap it, to get the full map and get the locations of starting points for the type of animal you selected, then right click on a marker to set a waypoint. Jump into your arc wing and let's head over. Proving that hunting is the shit, drop down and activate the poop at the marker and try not to step in it. Once you do, you will notice animal tracks appear. Follow the tracks until you reach the call point. The tracks can sometimes be hard to see, but they will lead to somewhere within the yellow circle on your mini-map. If all else fails, you can pull out your synthesis scanner to detect the call point. Once at the call point, take note of the wind by the direction your Sindana is flailing. You want to be downwind of the animals so they can't smell your bionic farts, so scout a good location in the direction your Sindana is pointing. Also make sure to eliminate any corpus enemies nearby, as their job is to piss you off and ruin your hunt. Once that is done, equip your tranquilizer if you haven't already, then hold down number 2 to select the echo lure for the animal you're hunting. A new UI will open towards the right side of the screen, which is going to be a visual representation of the frequency you are sending and receiving. Start with the call in the middle of the frequency range by left clicking and wait a few seconds. If you don't get a response, try a higher or lower frequency, or try sending some nudes. Once you hear a call back, you'll see the UI change to the frequency range you need to call back to. Move your mouse up or down to stay within that callback range. If you can't do that, then dating is probably not your thing. Once your call is accepted, that secondary UI will disappear and now it is time to get into position. Preferably from higher up, equip your trank gun and wait for the target to appear. While right-clicking, it will act as a pseudo-synthesis scanner pulling at a higher rate so you can see the animal. The Trank Rifle has a bit of fall-off and travel time, but it is easy to get used to. The reload time is long, so try to get it in the first shot. Now that you've knocked out your target like a Bill Cosby date, run over and activate it. You'll see the stats as well as the standing you've received. Hit Escape, then hold down number 2 again to equip the Echo Lure for the animal again. Hopefully this is fixed in a later patch, but for now it defaults back to the poppers. Hold down your map button and right click on your next target area. Hop in your arc wing and repeat the process. This is a different and more engaging way to earn standing if you get tired of mining and fishing. I hope DE will build on this and offer other hunting features in the future. The Vallis is a pretty vast area, so it's a good way to explore and just get to know the place. Now if only Tinder was this easy. That's all for this video, so thank you folks for tuning in, and take care. Nope. Nope. No. No. Ooh. I'd trank that.